All right, I'm gonna do a little bit of surgery really quickly. What is up, Joe Crew? It is me, Joku DMD, and today I got a box from Japan. This is a box from Japan, a thin box, yes, thin Japan box from Japan. This is Japan, and I get to meet the One Piece. That's right, I'm gonna meet the One Piece. Finally, I've been so excited to meet the One Piece. That's what it is. This is the meet the One Piece, I think. I think this box is thin enough. It looks like it should be the Meet the One Piece. Anyway, if you guys don't know about the Meet the One Piece, there is an event going on in Japan. It's big in Shibuya right now, I think. There's like a truck. I don't really know the details. Anyway, you go to this thing and you get to buy all this cool One Piece paraphernalia in celebration of the 25th anniversary of One Piece along with the release of the card game, Film Rev. There's all this exciting stuff going on. So anyway, I got this box from Mercari because if you're in Japan, you can meet the One Piece for 2200 yen i think but if you're outside of japan you're gonna meet the one piece for like a hundred bucks that's basically what it goes for i haven't found it much cheaper i found one for 70 bucks some for 80 bucks but basically this is a card set with a bunch of really great cards from the straw hats crew that is in this with alternate arts i don't know how shiny they are but apparently they're shiny i haven't been able to see it in any pictures so i'm gonna try and see if i can get these cards to look super shiny for you guys today and i hope you enjoy this thank you so much oh yeah and if you like this stuff and you find yourself here often maybe hit that subscription button it really helps me out thank you so much so this is it this is the meet the one piece i think there should be something in here there should be something in this box about the meet the one piece here oh yeah so these are the cards these are the pictures of the cards of the meet the one piece and this is the art here we go one piece card game the meet the one piece i've been so excited to see these with my eyeballs so this is very hype wow look at that cool art on here the whole gang is here look it's got ace and yamato and luffy and zoro and sanji and Ooh, I wonder if they're gonna do more of the Meet the One Piece stuff with maybe some of these other arts or characters on them. Hmm, hmm, that would be pretty cool. But here it is, this is Cardass. Cardass, One Piece, 25th, Shanks and Luffy. The trading of the hat, Bandai Namco, thank you so much. So let's get into this, the Meet the One Piece. Trip them this, the Meet the One Piece thing. This is it, it's in this nice, it's in this nice plastic plastic oh i think you're supposed to just open it up and look at the cards okay so these are all the cards very very cool but let's get let's get a good let's get a nice good close look at them i don't care about keeping these minty i want to play these cards oh yeah oh yeah they're shiny oh yeah these are some shiny cards all right so let's get into this all right i'm gonna do a little bit of surgery really quickly and get all these cards off of here because i do not trust myself to not bend these things so i'm gonna get them and then let's take a look at them I think we might need a Saksa Tetsu. Oh my goodness. These are really stuck to this thing. So I guess there's this tape. And I'm just going to take a knife and try and cut these off because this seems terrifying. Slicing Brooks out. Oh yeah, this seems to work pretty good. Yeah, that'll do it. I'd say that would do it. Slicing out Jinbei. Jinbei's got to get sliced out of here. Oh, Shimata. Ay, ay, ay. This is terrifying. Oh my god. <laughs> so I'd recommend doing the cards that you care about less. Sorry, Nico. You're just not quite as valuable to me as Chopper sometimes. I hope you can understand. I don't think you'd take that personally. Because you want to get the technique down. But I think I got the strat down. I'm just slicing them off from the back. And praying to God that I don't cut the cards because these things are so stuck. I don't know how you could get them off without bending them. Tony, Tony Chopper, I gotta do some surgery on you. I hope you don't mind me getting this off, but I'm experienced now and I can get to meet the One Piece cards off very easily. I now have my strip and strategy secured. So thank you so much. There we go. T-chops, baby. T-chops. Well, I'm so glad I had this amazing strip and blade. That would have been a nearly impossible endeavor. 
All right, so we got the cards out. Now let's take a look at these things and see how shiny they are. Oh yeah, look, okay, this is Usopp. It's really hard to show that they are shiny, but in person, it does reflect. It almost looks like metal, the way that they did this foiling on the side. But the line work is really cool on these cards. I think this is a very cool concept, but you can kind of see how, how shiny it is there. This is Usopp from the starter deck. He's the one that trigger play this card and when he's Dawn X2, his attack can't be blocked. So it's a pretty strong card. I do actually like the other Usopp better from the main set because he actually draws you a card. And then we got Furanki Fresh Fire. Look at that awesome super pose in the background there. It's really good. I love I love the artwork on these. They're, they're really really awesome. And this and the shiny is really subtle. Also, it's definitely easier to see in person. But hopefully, this gives you guys an idea of how shiny these cards are. You can actually see the shininess more so from the contrast of the the artwork here. And these are also really shiny and glossy themselves. And then they also have this shiny bottom border. It's pretty nice. And then we got Jimbei. Jimbei, wow, look at him all chained up. About to go search for Ace. That's what I'm talking about. He's about to do that Fishman Karate. You don't, wanna, you don't wanna catch that drip. Let me tell you one thing, kids. You do not wanna catch the drip from this Fishman Karate fist. Pretty sure that, yeah, this is the starter deck one. Dawn X1, when he swings, you can give something plus 1K. And then we got Robin Chuan. I think this Robin Chuan is so much better looking than the regular starter deck with Robin Chuan. Of course, it's shiny. You, you gotta love stuff that's shiny. It's really, really cool. And I just love this stylized. You can, you can really see this is like Oda's line work. I wonder if he actually drew these himself. It could be, I wouldn't know. And the Buruks, this is the main set broke, so I'm pretty sure this is a Dawn X one when he swings, you give two character cards minus 2K. Pretty good. I've seen some really interesting stuff with the starter Brooks actually, how you can kind of sneak him in and give cards Dawn and stuff like that, so really good. Oh, this is the promo Luffy. So this is number one promo. You can see it right there. He's a uh, Dawn X2. He gains Rush, I think, or something like that. But he's a six cost and it's pretty big. 9K Rush, I think. It's pretty, pretty strong. But I like his art as well. Central. See, it's shiny. And this is the same image that's on the first set Dawn special. Special Luffy Dawn. Kaizokuoni, ore wa naro. Something like that. Sanji Swam. This is the main set Sanji you can see because he's 2k so this guy's got an alternate art and a main set card and now he's got this version it's really good i'm definitely gonna play one of these if there's the high rarity cards i like to play one of each so i can have fun seeing each of them in my deck so i think you know this is definitely gonna get one of those spots in my deck i like this card he's activate main you take a life and then you put two rested dawn on him and he gets plus 2k power so pretty strong card he basically becomes a 7k for one life and he's got a 2k counter so pretty pretty strong Sanji Swan. And then of course, Nami Swan. Nami Swan, I'm pretty sure this is the one. Yeah, she's 2K. So you play her, search top five, grab a straw hat and put it at the top or, or then you put the rest at the bottom. Yeah, so pay for one, search top five and grab a straw hat and stick it on the bottom. Very, very strong card. Nice to search stuff. And then Zoro, Zoro. This is pretty cool. This is uh, the Zoro leader. You can see that he's, it looks like that sword's about to fall out of his mouth, but let me tell you, it is not and he may or may not know where he's going. But yeah, pretty shiny. I'm definitely gonna do a deck profile on this leader now that I have a alter, that I have a more rare leader card. I was not about to do a deck profile with a regular leader card that I pulled out of the box, but I have built a deck on him. I think this leader's actually pretty good. I'd say he's the most viable red leader, mono red. I mean, not that there's that many, but he's definitely better than Luffy. So really, really strong card. He's been doing well in some events. Uh, I think the rush, pure rush strat is pretty cool with him. And then of course, T-Chops, baby. T-Chops. Hey, T-Chops. T-Chops. He's a good guy. This T-Chops. He's a good guy. He's the doc. You know, ship doc. One energy blocker. You just pay one and then you have a blocker. So it's basically like a negate. You can just play this for one and then he's going to absorb an attack. And if you're really nasty and you're at two life and you have a paradise waterfall and a radical beam in hand, you can put this guy up to 7k and untap him to get a second block out of him. So T-Chops gets in there. You don't want to sleep on this boy. He's really nice. And I trimmed my list down to two. I'm playing some other blockers in my list now for red green law. So I'm I'm definitely gonna max out on these tea chops because I like these a lot better than the starter deck one. So the starter deck one is very cute, but this art slams. And look at that, shiny, shiny, shiny. I really, really like the contrast of the art of the character, the color art with the background. It really makes it stand out and pop. 
I think they did a great job with these cards. Uh, I think they're just shiny and beautiful. So I hope you guys like them as well. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I think these cards look pretty awesome. And I think they did a good selection. I like how they did the straw hats, you know, meet the one piece. So you get to open this book and you get to meet the one piece. I just met the one piece and it felt great. It felt absolutely fantastic. fantastic. I am a dentist. I can't end without doing a dental tooth tip. My dental tooth tip to you would be make sure you meet your dentist also. It's important because you should get your teeth cleaned at least twice a year. Some people need it three, four, I see some people six times a year even you know it really varies person to person but make sure you're getting your teeth cleaned enough for you to keep them healthy and go meet your dentist just like I'm meeting the one piece right now thank you so much